What is going on everybody? Stabs here, welcome back to another of my videos. Uh, today we're actually going to be trying out the Gorgon uh, LMG. I've been hearing a lot of things um, about it, so I actually decided to uh, give it a try and see what all the fuss is about basically. And um, I did actually use this in my video where I dropped the 100 plus kills, so if you guys haven't checked that out, go check it out. <coughs> um, it should be one of my most more recently videos. But um, this gun is uh, has actually been really, really good before, so that they actually buffed it. Um, not buffed it. I always say buff instead of nerf, but they've nerfed it at least two or three times because it's had probably one of the higher KDs uh, in the game. And this dude over here is trying to stun. The fire rate on it is really, really low. Um, but it basically two-shots anybody that you'll find. So uh, whatever it makes up in uh, fire rate... 100% um, it makes up in damage and um, accuracy because you guys can see it's really really accurate um, From my actual class. I'm not really running quick draw uh, just because I don't have it unlocked. What is this guy doing? I don't really have it unlocked because I don't really use this gun too much But um, it's fine because I'm not really planning on actually moving around with this gun too much I'm kind of trying to stay at a distance uh, unless I Unless I kind of want to get just melted over and over again at close range. So, this range right here is fine. I'm just absolutely, I don't know. I'm just pretty much obliterating them right now. Um, they should spawn by me somewhere. Yep. I always pick the worst times to reload. Right when I started reloading, two of them pushed that tunnel. I was close to shrieks. And let's see if they actually push this. I really, I'm not really a fan of the red dot anymore. What the hell was that? Because I've been using the ELO on basically any gun that requires a red dot. And I just got really, really used to that. So this just feels really, really weird to use the red dot. But like I said, I don't have pretty much any attachments. I just have the red dot uh, just because I don't really use this gun. And uh, I'm basically just going to try and stay in this house. Uh, I thought I just saw something. You guys can see, I, I'm pretty sure I just two shot at that guy. This gun is just absolutely OP. I remember the first time they actually nerfed it. What am I saying? The first time they nerfed it was because um, everyone was having like a 1.2, I think, KD with it. So it was really, really OP. For sure, they're about to peak that. Let me actually reload. I'm 14-3 right now. 4.67 KD. And the game... Oh, God. The game kind of just started. And it's still, I guess you could say, viable at close range. Um... But if somebody has like a Vesper, you're never going to beat them with this. But say if they're hurt or something, you can still kind of get the two shots in. And um, you can still get the kill. But this thing, like you guys just saw right there, it's absolutely like, it just shreds you at far range. You have nothing to do. Like this, if I had a chance, like this thing's probably better than like a sniper at close range. Just because of the amount of bullets you can shoot really, really quick. And of how accurate it is. But I don't know if this kid is still up here somewhere. I don't know where these dudes are spawning at. Let me pull out my pistol really quick. And they're spawning on the other side of the map. What the hell did you get? I just, I just got th shot through the wall. You have got to be kidding me. Where are these guys? Right, I'm going to pull out my pistol and just push this out. Alright. So I think they're over here somewhere. Yep. Pull this thing out again. As you guys saw right there, it's not like completely ass at close range, but uh, they'll basically just rip you apart at like far distances. And um, 48 Dredge, that's another really, really good guy actually. But 19.5 basically carrying um, my team. You guys saw I was just on the top of the leaderboards, and uh, that guy's really lucky he didn't challenge. This dude's about to come through here. Oh, is that kid? Unless he just died. Uh, give it like three seconds. Uh, yeah, I guess he's gone. Let me push this right here. And, uh... That was hurt, I'm pretty sure. That guy's got the complete schlong. Let me pull out the pistol really quick. Not sure if anybody's in here. There's one guy. Oh. Oh, working magic with the RK5. 
There is so much glass in this house. You barely have to touch it and just just makes so much noise. But uh, let's reload this really quick. That's a really bad thing about this. It takes years to reload, and the game's actually over. Um, went 23 and five. Uh, that was actually a really quick game. But um, you guys saw this was kind of a uh, SMG and AR type of map. There's kind of short ranges and long ranges. But um, I'm actually gonna hop into another TDM and uh, let's see if we get a different kind of map so I can kind of show you what it does. Yes, you're there 23 and five. Um, I'll see you guys in a couple seconds. El Taco Bueno. Alrighty. I like it. Alright guys, so we actually got hunted this time. And let me show you guys the class. I actually took off my perk too. I'm pretty sure I had fast hands on. And I actually unlocked uh, quick draw that game. So you guys can see it doesn't really help at all actually. I don't think it actually did anything. But um, <clears throat> we are on hunted now. Um, depending on what side of the map you're usually on. It's actually really easy to hold down with ARs. Usually there's somebody right here somewhere head glitching it there usually there's a bunch of other people um but usually they, if they're not pushing this that means they're kind of spawning behind us oh yeah i kind of predicted a little bit too late um but either way he did have another gun um so he just basically melted let me pull out my pistol wait until i get a little bit closer piece with the rk5 oh my god if i somehow kill that kid too that would have been amazing but uh start off pretty good so far let's see if we could actually we shot right there that was sexy uh usually wall banging with this gun is actually pretty efficient i guess if that's how you want to put it um i'm not sure what gun that guy just had i don't know if that was either the gorgon or the 48 dredge, but either way, I didn't really have much of a chance. Uh, it should be spawning, I think, over here. Okay, you could. Oh my god, if I hit those shots, like I was out. Well, we're 5 and 4 right now. Not really starting off to a pretty good KD. Um, just need to start kind of picking them off as they run. Which was the perfect example right there. And right there, my shot was kind of shaky, so that guy killed me. Right as I started reload, like I said, people decide. So I get the worst timing ever when it comes to reloading. But I don't know if there's somebody. I'm pretty sure there's a guy up there. Nope. Probably ran away. He's probably gonna flank us, but it's not my, not my problem right now. Somebody up there usually. Guess not there. Let's jump out the window. Ride the little bridge. And let's see where are they. I easily jack that kid's kill. Let me pull out the pistol really quick. And we go. Uh, it looks like they're all spawning on the other side of the map, or actually not. If, we, yeah, I remember, if they just start spawning there and I could spawn kill them with the Gorgon, I'm gonna get a bunch of kills, but I'm pretty sure. That kid's jumping up. Oh my god, I almost missed a lot of sides. But you guys can see on the top right of the mini-map, actually. That's where they spawn. And if I could just chill right here with this Gorgon. And they actually come behind me. That's a really weird spawn for them. Because they could kind of just flank around you if you're in that building. But um, if you kind of have somebody watching your back, you can get kind of posted up. Uh, let's see, where is Pretty sure this dude's coming around that way. We could have tried, but not gonna happen. I'm kind of waiting for my perfect time to actually call in my scythe. Um, but I mean, these guys could just keep trying to keep trying to shoot me down. I'm gonna reload real quick. It's about to take like five seconds, and then I'm gonna challenge that kid up there. Hopefully, I don't actually get. Let me just Y Y really quick. Oh yeah. Um, kind of miss a bunch of shots right there. 16 to 7. Um, let's see, let's see, where are we gonna go? I'm not really sure where they're spawning too much right now. Let me actually call this Scython. Oh, oh, wow. Alright. Um, wasn't really expecting that kid to be there. Not really sure why he was there. Alrighty, just get spawn killed again. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Is this his kid? Where did he just kill me over here? I'm pretty sure I still hear him. How does he still have that? Alright. 
Alright, thanks for the kill. Uh, let's see, where is it? Got a dart. Alright. Let me get up top up here, pull out my pistol. Yeah, he killed him, never mind. But, I'm not sure where these dudes are at right now. Let me pull out the pistol and just push this upstairs. Game's going by pretty Oh, almost jacked his kill. But, uh, let's push this window, or door, or whatever you guys want to call it. Um, usually, oh god. Usually you expect them to just keep spawning here, which they are now, but... I'm just waiting for them to actually just start peeking this up here. Down there, or whatever. Same thing. Alright, thanks for the kill. Mm, let's go, people. Get my way to this UAV. This dude should be jumping up. Pretty sure that was him. Let me call this in. I'm actually start getting into a little bit more action. So let's see if I could just. Alrighty, that's why you don't want to get in a lot of action with the Gorgon. Like I said uh, earlier in the video, the fire rate with it is really bad. So you can't really expect to um, move around with this too much. Let's. You just kind of want to just get posted up with it. And um, close range, you could be really deadly with it if you do hit your headshots. And I'm not really trying to fall off right here, but if that guy... For sure, I'm just just far enough to watch them spawn. But I'm trying to watch the right side of my map. So they... Uh, I'm not really sure what this... Oh, please tell me I got this kill. So if you guys saw right there, if this probably went up to 100... Um, I could have spawn trapped because I saw at least two other people there. This gun's really, really good for spawn trapping on Nuketown. It's really annoying. If you have two people, three people watching mid-map or whatever, they can never get through. Just as long as you don't let them actually get close enough to you, um, you should be completely fine. Uh, it's kind of what I did in my video where I dropped uh, 100 plus kills. But I hope you guys enjoy. If you do, please don't forget to subscribe. Uh, let me know what you guys think about the Gorgon. If you guys think it's good, let me know. Or if you guys think it's bad, let me know. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please don't like to comment, subscribe, follow the social media links down in the description below. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time. Peace out.